how to manage material consumption record on site welcome to my youtube channel so you can see here we have a daily reports excel sheet which uh, enable me to manage material consumption record on site i will show you how you can prepare this uh, excel sheet so you can see i have different uh, sheets i have sheets for materials on site i have sheet for materials received and i have sheets for material used so let's go to sheets for materials received you just need to uh, prepare this uh, add a sheet for this material you have cement you have sand you have ballast you have timber you have uh, foundation stone reinforcement uh, machine cast stone, roofing, nails, and um, blah blah blah. So, uh, let's say today I've received 30. I've received, uh, let's say, 500 bags of cement, right? And uh, I have used, I will use, let's say, 200 bags of cement, okay? used uh, let's say 200 bags of cement okay. so let's see um format you can format this cell so uh all right okay this is the area of operation so we are not filling here we are filling here so this is the area of operation, let's say, are we operating in? I can still format this cell. Just general. Okay. And then the area of operation maybe is, um, we are doing, um, we are doing concrete to, uh, let's say, uh, concrete to uh, footings block nine block one okay and so we have used 200 bags of cement out of the 500 that we received so what will be my, my material on site so we are on date 26 this one is date uh, 18 so the dates have to be consistent with each other okay so we are here we are on date so i can change the date we're starting with date 24 of october date 24 here we are on date 18 here we should be on date 18 and also here the dates should be consistent we are on date 18th november 2023 uh so here should be date 18th november 2023 so this one this one should be consistent okay so i can uh just come here so this one needs to be so i can maybe uh let me remove this okay so here should be equals to materials uh material on site this one that is the uh, material that was on site the previous day again plus materials received this one enter so minus material used this one enter you see how we arrived uh, at that answer so the material on site now on that day will be 430 uh, bags on of cement. Okay. We, you will do the same thing for maybe we received um, how many tons of sand? Maybe we received uh, let's say 100 tons of sand. And how many tons of uh, ballast? 
we receive let's say 70 tons of ballast so when you come here you can just um, um let's say do the same thing here just let's move this will be equals to the material on site it will be equals to the material on site on the previous day plus the material received that is 100 enter again minus material used how we used how many bags of uh, tons of sun let's say we used uh, 40 and we used 30 so this one will be equals to uh, we are on date um date 18 okay so minus material used this one enter so you can see what we are remaining with okay so we can just maybe just uh, drag this but it still remain the same so let's say I maybe delete and just check this and drag it you can see the formula is now copied where it is this minus material received plus material received minus materials used okay then uh, you can just uh, drag it up to the end okay let's see now uh, um, let's say the material on site on date 18 on date 18 that is timber uh, you can see it is 643 let's say we used uh, we received um, let's say we received um, let's say um, 1,000 yeah. uh, here we received let's say uh, 1,000 I mean 100 uh, let's say 200 2,000 2, um, 1,000 we can go to foundation stone maybe we received uh, it is in feet square we received uh, 2,300 feet square so material used so here i can just expand okay materials on site so i'll go to material used okay now this one uh, this one is not material uh, received so material received uh, can be let's say we received uh, 2000 here 3000 here uh, 2000 and here we received 2000 so let's see material used material on site so the formula here um, I can just make uh, maybe delete delete we are on the dating all right uh, delete, 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 delete. Then I just uh, pick to here, then just drag the formula. Okay. Now the previous day there was no material on site, but is that correct? So I can just maybe uh, start from this point. Let me delete. So I can maybe uh, drag. Just like that. Material used. Material received is. Material is 1000. Material received is 2000. Therefore, we remain with 1000. Uh, as from that date so the next day we just maybe we did not receive we just used on date 19 we just used maybe 500 yeah we just used maybe um 300 
maybe you just use here 500 and here we just used maybe um, 800 so material on site you can see the material has reduced you see the material has reduced to um So you can see there is an error because instead of material increasing, it is reducing. So let's check the formula again. So material received, material used. So this one should be, um, here should be equals to material on site. So this basically means it's on the negative. You can see, uh, you can see, um, we are using material that we don't have. That's why this has a bracket. It means it's negative. So uh, the best thing is to assume that uh, we had received maybe uh, 3,000. We are still on the negative. Material received. Material used. So here we are on the negative. So it means that here we, we never received any material, but we have used, which cannot be accurate. That is why this one is in brackets, right? So it means we did not receive anything and we have used. So you can see, uh, you can be able to track that error. So here you can see that on the team, they say we received 3000. So that, now that bracket will go. Material on site will be now 2000 and then 1500 right so that's how you can uh, now you can be tracking the materials on site uh, each and every day using Microsoft Excel now you can be able to track materials consumption okay using Microsoft Excel so I will end this video there for today if you like my video please do consider to subscribe to my youtube channel for more videos like this i will see you in a in my next uh video thank you